banished from Earth Classic Game Room broadcasts from the Intergalactic Space Arcade on its never-ending mission to review everything. Welcome to Classic Game Room, where it's always a great day to blow things up in outer space, especially when it's on an Atari computer. This is Asteroids. So it's the future, and space is littered with rocks, otherwise known as asteroids, that you have to shoot with your spaceship and then break into little pieces and then shoot them for points. All the while dodging UFOs. It's a great game. We've all played Asteroids. And it's available on just about everything, but not a single version of Asteroids compares to the arcade machine. Which is superior to all. That's normally the case. But there's a reason that you might want this version of Asteroids. Because it's awesome. And not just the single player mode, which is sufficient, but you know, not nearly as good as the real thing. It's the multiplayer modes of Asteroids that make it great. Before I get into that, we're watching a single player game of Asteroids. As you can see, the Atari XE computer easily handles the visual presentation and sounds of Asteroids. Which are pretty basic by today's standards, obviously, but Asteroids remains fun and playable more than three decades after its release. How many games today will be able to say the same thing? Asteroids is just classic perfection. For a 1982 or 83 home console or home computer release, it's terrific. Because it, it just gets the job done. And I was mistaken about the date. This is a 1981 release for the Atari computers. The single player mode is pretty good, but the multiplayer is where Asteroids really shines. Something you don't actually get with the arcade machine. No, there, there was a later Asteroids release. And I uh, can't remember if they changed the name of the game that, that had the multiplayer stuff, but you get it here. Multiplayer Asteroids. Invite over a friend and have a great time. We, we seriously had a hard time putting this down. You can actually play one to four player multiplayer Asteroids. I'm playing Brandon here. Two player cooperative gameplay, but, but you can also play like Space War and try to kill each other, which is a lot of fun. However, even though this is on the computer, kids, let me stress, there's no internet. Because online gameplay cannot handle the power of the Atari XE computer and its Easter pastel colored buttons. There's a couple versions of cooperative gameplay in that one. Brandon ran out of lives. Even though my game was going really well, he ruined it for both of us. Thanks, Brandon. That's your payback, it's deathmatch time! I couldn't figure out how to get the hyperspace mode going, but if you pull back on the joystick or the thumb pad, you will activate a shield which comes in quite handy. Unless you don't use it properly, in which case you still explode. <laughs> As it turns out, all of our deathmatch games were really short. They all pretty much ended up like this. Asteroids for the Atari home computer. Highly recommended. In fact, I recommend pretty much every version of Asteroids. It's a great classic game. And the multiplayer modes in this version are fabulous. Asteroids! Oh! 